Hi, Stephen Callahan here at the SJC Week Fab Lab with another episode of Fast App Scripts for Teachers. We're going to cover uh, some kind of basic coding inside of a Google Sheet, and it's only going to take us a few minutes. Let's get started. So we're going to look at a program that just does some counting for us. That's all. We're going to have it to count inside uh, of a sheet. Now, this could be useful uh, in a lot of things. We're, we're actually uh, going to show you how some of this code can be used in another program in a different show. But uh, this one, we're, we're just showing you how to have um, counting occur inside of that sheet. And as we're doing that, we're, we're also going to be fulfilling uh, California Computer Science Standard 6-8 AP 11. Well, what is that? It's just about creating clearly named variables. Uh, variables, just like they are in math, are uh, these things that are storing information inside of our program. Let's check it out. So uh, here we have our program. Well, it, it looks like a, a Google Sheet, but if I go in this Google Sheet, to Tools and Script Editor, what it'll do is it'll bring up the Script Editor. So I already had this tab open. Let's kind of walk through this program quickly. Uh, it says Function, My Function. Uh, all uh, app script programs uh, in the editor start with a My Function function. Um, so I can say My Cell. And uh, the cell is taking from the spreadsheet app the active spreadsheet, the active cell. So wherever the, the cursor is, kind of. Anyway, um, then I'm going to make a cell that I'm going to use uh, temporarily. So I named it temp cell. Uh, notice I'm, I'm trying to come up with logical names for my variables. I, I want it to make sense if someone else needs to read it uh, and maybe update it or help me debug. Or maybe I'm working in a team. So then here, what we do is we put into goal, where we're trying to go with our counting, the value that's in that cell that we've chosen. Then we have a loop here. And what the loop does is it, it just keeps on counting up to the goal and adding in the number in the cell. So let's, let's try it out. I'm going to say I want to count to. 15. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit I'm going to save. And I'm going to hit this play button. Okay, it counted to 15. And we could have our program to go much further. Right now, we have some code that'll allow us to count. Have fun with coding and uh, come on back and we'll 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 write some more code and we'll learn another standard.